Hello Virgos, this is the weekly spread for you, the second week of June from 8th till 14th. And the bottom of the deck, Ten of Swords. It's in this deck, you see there is no cat. In this deck, uh, the meaning of Ten of Swords more like we have when uh, we have to submit to unpleasant situations, unpleasant circumstances. Uh, like we are not the master of the situation, you know, we have to just... Uh, we are there, we don't like it, but we have to be there for some reason. But it's only weekly, it's general, please keep it in mind all the time. What is crowning your reading? The Tower card. It's unexpected change. Quite often it's unpleasant for us because this cat is like falling down and he didn't expect to fall out from there when lightning went in this tower and he's like meow he's scared but what i wanted to, to say to you that uh, it's unexpected um, change what we don't like but uh, it's from lunomang cards I pulled the 36 card, it's called Cross. And you know, like you, it's like karma. It's something what we can't avoid, no matter what. So for all uh, Virgos, it will be different. The, um, how you call it, how strong it will be. Maybe in daily life, it will not be something huge. It can be some small thing. For instance, uh, you had a co-worker who you ha you were like a friend, and this week, this co-worker getting fired, somebody's gossiping about this at the work. You can't change the situation. You can't do anything that he or she will not be fired. You have to accept it, and you don't like it. So you're losing like a friend at work. For instance, it can be like this. It doesn't have to be with you. Not necessarily. I'm always, I, I began to, you know, I have a crisis in my reading because, uh, you know, like i afraid to tell the truth to the people. When these cards came out, of course, uh, it can be when somebody is getting fired. But for some of you, for most of you, it's not you, it's happening with somebody. But it's it has nothing to do this tower with your uh, private life, like home, family and relationships. Because it here all cards, they are stable, they are nice, they are quiet and calm. So it has to do with somebody at your work or in some other spheres of your life, not here. Well, let's start. Home and family. Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands, some new beginnings. Uh, enthusiasm. Uh, maybe you're starting something new. But for me, these new beginnings from something old. You see, because from old tree came this fresh uh, leaves. Uh, I don't know how you call this, but you understand. New tree came from old tree. So for me, it's not like you're moving somewhere. You're doing some th starting, starting to do some things at a home, but in the new way, for instance. Some new beginnings. Just uh, be, um, how you call it? Don't be too enthusiastic because when we are so passionate, God knows what we can do. <laughs> it can be um, like uh, when we're getting too enthusiastic, we can make some mistakes. Be careful about this. But this is positive card. Uh, love and relationships. Six of Pentacles. It's, uh, as you remember, giving and receiving. It can be some uh, small gifts, some presents, some help. Uh, help uh, talks with... Uh, with your loved ones, with your friends. For those of you who are looking for a new relationship, what I see this week, like you have a great relationship and conversations with your family, friends, but maybe you will be too busy with something else to like 
uh, have some new start or something like this. And at work, job and career, page of sorts, it's, uh, it can be gossip, it can be bad news, unpleasant for us. Uh, for those of you whose work are intellectual, it's quite normal card when you're using your intellect. You're working, you're thinking things through in a serious way. And it's also a card of spying and sneaking. So be careful if you... Um, have some uh, things what can be like stolen or some things what you don't know people to know to see be careful about this watch for your stuff information computer passwords all these things think about it because it's like somebody sneaking around I when I I don't know late this made this spread you know what I was thinking about if there are some Virgos who has been like I don't know the right word I don't want to run for the dictionary like for instance they are working somewhere in authority and they like using their <laughs> position and taking money from people you understand like corruption. And if they have been doing this, for some time, somebody like police was sneaking and looking, uh, like spying on them. And this week, they will get caught. Because it's obvious, Ten of Swords, the Tower, uh, this Page of Swords. So, it can be like this. But, uh, as I told you, it doesn't have to be with you. Don't worry, don't think, just... Keep your information what you need. Or if maybe you you spying or you trying to get some kind of information. Maybe it's you. It doesn't have to be like somebody sneaking on you. But it's a card of spy. Of a card of when we're trying to get some information. Not always in legal way. We need this information sometimes, so we, we're sneaking around and looking for this. Money situation, the devil. Devil, car, devil likes money, he loves the money. The only one thing, he's a liar. Uh, like he can give us money and take something from us. It's in the <laughs> very high meaning. Um, for me, devil always let us make money. Uh, but for some uh, Virgos, it can be because when we depended uh, from somebody or something very badly, it also can be the devil. But for me, more, more like, uh, it can be dirty money, if you understand what I mean. Like uh, when money from, uh, when people not paying tax from this money, you know, like we make some extra money, but they are... We're not paying taxes from them. I'm, I'm just telling what it means. It, I'm not blaming any of you. Please uh, excuse me if it sounds like this. Uh, because we are all people and things different, uh, different things happening with us. <clears throat> because of this tower, because something uh, happened suddenly, unexpected, in the challenge position, you have the Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles, it's stability. When we're sure in our tomorrow, when we are, have this support, everything is so stable, we sure that we have money tomorrow, day after tomorrow, we have some savings. And you feel like it's not 100% of stability this week because something shaked in your life. So you like losing this uh, feeling of complete stability. It's nothing scary. I hope this will play out for you in a very light way. Like just you will see that something ending or happening with someone else. Uh, but try to take it easy. It's 
you can't avoid this tower because of this cross from Lunamang. It's impossible to avoid it, so just uh, accept it. It's only one week. Maybe it will be a very small thing. I wish you, honestly, dear Virgos, I wish you love, la, l I don't know, luck, abundance, and everything should go quiet and stable for you. I wish you luck. See you soon.